We thank Allah as much as He deserves. We be witness that there is no God but Allah without any partners. And we be witness that Muhammad is His servant and messenger, the one who guides to the straight path. Pray Allah and do not violate His commands and do not sin. It is the will for the nations before us to fear Allah. From the signs of accepting acts of worship, you are always consistent upon worship, like salah, fasting, night prayers, charity, reading Quran, and worship after Ramadan. At the same momentum is, is the sign that these worships are accepted in Ramadan. You stay on the straight path is a better title for being consistent on worship. Those who say Allah is our Lord, and they stay straight, they have no fear or sadness. Also know that from the signs of accepting your worship is that you succeed to perform in worship on the best form. And from the signs of worship being accepted is that you do not go back to sin after you repent in any form or image. Dear Muslims, the Lord of Ramadan is the same Lord of Shawwal and the same Lord of every month. Do not be among those who erect themselves in the month of Ramadan. Then when Ramadan finish, they go back to their old way. It would be a great loss to become a loser again after you were guided in this month of Ramadan. It's the light of going back to drinking after you erected yourself and you have done all this act of worship. Another sign of worship being accepted is that you love doing worship with honesty and sincerity and you hate falling back into sin. Also you please Allah and you pray to Him all the time that He keep you steadfast and firm on, on worshiping until death. From the signs of worship being accepted is that you do not underestimate any small act of worship or you see yourself shown off doing it. And do not even get closer to any reason that would lead to sinning because that will make you go into the sin itself. O oh, believers, rejoice in this day and make your family happy by bringing happiness to them. Be grateful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for this blessing and pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that He accepted our good actions. Wear the best of clothes, donate and greet one another and visit one another and look to connect and meet with each other, far or near. And today you have no reason or excuse why you cannot connect with your family with today's meet, social media and today's technology. And fast the six days of Shawwal, it is the way of the Prophet Sallallahu it's a voluntary fast. And be generous with women, as the Prophet Sallallahu commanded us, exchange gifts and love one another. And do not forget to make dua for your brothers and sisters all over the world. And what's going on today from the crisis and tragedies and the disasters we see going all over the world with our brothers and sisters, especially in the month of Ramadan, the month of blessing, of peace, in the month of the Quran. And that Allah will make this Ummah victorious and empowerment. And celebrate this day with your family and your friends, as Islam is a religion of peace and, and happiness in one Ummah. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to solve all the problems and tragedies all over the world and save the bloodshed of the Muslims that's going on as we see today. Do not forget to make dua for your brothers in Al-Aqsa.